no problems here. Just take your time and keep exiting the building. There's no need to punch up and run. Take your time. There's no problems here. Thank you. Our thoughts and prayers are with the victims and the families and friends of all those affected. It is now beyond doubt that the people of Manchester and of this country have fallen victim to a callous terrorist attack, an attack that targeted some of the youngest people in our society with cold calculation. All acts of terrorism are cowardly attacks on innocent people, but this attack stands out for its appalling, sickening cowardice, deliberately targeting innocent, defenceless children and young people who should have been enjoying one of the most memorable nights of their lives. The police and security services believe they know the identity of the perpetrator, but at this stage of their investigations, we cannot confirm his name. For as so often while we experienced the worst of humanity in Manchester last night, we also saw the best. The cowardice of the attacker met the bravery of the emergency services and the people of Manchester. The attempt to divide us met countless acts of kindness that brought people closer together. And in the days ahead, those must be the things we remember.
Let us remember those who died. And let us celebrate those who helped, safe in the knowledge that the terrorists will never win. And our values, our country and our way of life will always prevail.